are sign waving in front of Bachman Lawn in, um, to support the protectors that have been on the Mauna and all of their sacrifices physically and um, the energy that they've been putting towards this and we just felt like it was needed to have this on campus at this time. And um, definitely just to, to celebrate kind of the ruling that went out yesterday, Tuesday, uh, that was supposed to happen uh, where construction workers were supposed to go back on the Mauna. So definitely as a uh, kind of like a celebratory reminder uh, to people in town and in Manoa and also to the students, get, getting them aware um, and also bringing UH's attention back to this issue and also reminding them that uh, they have to remain a, a Hawaiian place of learning and what does that definition mean uh, to us as Hawaiian people and what does it mean to them and what's their intent. So also just keeping uh, them in the loop and making sure they know that we're still here and we're still fighting uh, for these issues that continue to happen and uh, UH continually to be involved in these type of um, actions. So definitely keeping their, them aware and let them know that we're here and that Hawaiian people belong at this school and that they need to stick to what they, what they say and what they propose. In terms of kala um, and the idea of money and science, um, one example I can think of is just me being a college student. Um, am I going here uh, just because of the pay? Like, am I gonna graduate here thinking of, oh, I'm only in college because I want better pay in the future? Or am I in college because I wanna produce scholarly work? You know, there's a difference between going to school for its intended purposes, which for me is to produce scholarly works and then just go. To learn and then versus like going to school just because I want a better paying job I want good pay so I mean it all relates back to this whole idea of the TNT construction of the TNT with science and money what is it really for how is that affecting science and I think in with nowadays um, I this is my opinion. I think science right now is distorted and it's probably more in the best interest of just greed and money without like bringing forth any new learning materials, you know. And I, I do know that uh, part of the reason UH is supporting the TMT, like what we, our lease over there, like what we, we get it for free and then we sublease to all these telescopes in countries for like a dollar a year. And if, like if you do the math, I think it's like it costs like, uh, like what, three thousand dollars to look through one of these telescopes for like one minute, and like, okay, they're doing that for like, I can't do math, but it ends up being like a million dollars a year for one telescope, and UH, like their whole part in it is like we get to use it for free. Our astronomy students get to use it for free, and that's all fine and good, but like. How are the people seeing it? That's ceded lands. Those are Hawaiian lands, but we're not profiting. Like our kupuna aren't getting any money. We didn't get any money, you know. And like Poliahu's up there. Like what? How is this affecting um, our culture and our religion and like all of our mo'opuna and like the water table up there? You might like they're gonna have a 5,000 gallon or ton tank underground where they're gonna be storing hazardous. Uh, materials, ha hazardous waste that is gonna seep into the water table, like under Mauna Kea. Like that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt like my grandbabies, my great great grandbabies, and I'm not okay with that. You know, like money is not worth that. I don't want to kill my descendants just for money. Fui kapono. Holding up the culture, yeah. keeping that 
like in focus, but the support of the TMT is just in complete opposition to that. You know, like, um, and what they're just making money off it. Profit is not a whole, like prop, like money is not a Hawaiian thing. The dala is like an introduction of the Western, yeah, yeah Western concept, and it just doesn't make sense. And who is it really benefiting though? Like, as this TMT could benefit, they say the argument is it's going to benefit mankind, just humanity, just like advancements in science, which is cool, but Hawaiians already showed that we've had indigenous knowledge. We, we know how to do this. We, we had a working knowledge of astronomy. So, who's to say with like, the advancement of science is going to um, progress us, at least in our you know, time, like for modern Hawaiians, you know? Uh, why can't we use what we already know and go with that? So that's the, my take on that. And they've already had 12 other telescopes on there. Like, this would be 13? This would be 13, like three. Too many telescopes. Yeah. TNT. Too many desecrations to the land. Like, it's unnecessary, especially the impact that it has on the Mauna. So, yeah. Right. <laughs> and I think it, it's, um, it's very wrong of UH to say that they are a Hawaiian place of learning. When we are not, they're not like reinforcing the culture, like yeah, Hawaiian studies. But I mean, how does the rest of the campus benefit from this Hawaiian place of learning? Other than that, it is the University of Hawaii. It's just, I don't know. It doesn't make sense to me. I can't, I can't reconcile this in my head. I've been trying for months. It all years. comes down to just money and greed. I mean, just the politics behind that. So really, and if it's into that, what is? What are these institutions that claim to be Hawaiian? What are they doing for the Hawaiian community? How are they if it's about, yeah. Hawaiian people, yeah. Right? If this is about money, well, how are they going to benefit us? You know, are they going to give us anything? That's the question. I mean, are they going to be paying every single Hawaiian student? Are we going to get free tuition? Right. <laughs> free tuition, UH. Come on, <laughs> step it up. Yeah. <laughs> So a lot of this money goes to like admins and doesn't necessarily go professors. Admin, yeah, well, and I know like a lot of the science professors are like, yeah, this is good, you know, because science. But it's like, well, what about indigenous science, indigenous ways of knowing? That's not really helping us. We already know. We already figured it out. If you, if everyone's behind us, if like these non-Hawaiians cannot get on board with our thinking, then I'm sorry, but I don't think. Uh -huh. They shouldn't desecrate our Mauna, our most sacred site, because they uh, are running behind times. I mean, I mean, science should be like a part of nature, part of society, yeah. and not do heavy things right. you know, and totally. to, like, to learn. Yeah. Progress, like, okay, scientific progress, but or desecration in the name of progress. Right. That doesn't. If we're like progressing, we shouldn't be destroying what's around us. To figure out a way to do it without impacting everything else. Yeah. So, so, so we're here. We're we're here today, uh, uh, in in support of, uh, I guess. In support of the Mauna. Yeah. Yeah, definitely not in support of this telescope.